Hello, this is the intro for my small series of Off Minute Hero Super Mega Neo Climax Ultimate Boy Hero 30, going for the one achievement for um, <sighs> I know what it's called is the yeah legalized it already yeah so basically I have to beat the entirety of this campaign mode the uh, hero 30 campaign um, without using any herbs whatsoever to heal I think I can purchase herbs I just can't I just can't uh, use them to heal also at the same time, I will be trying to... No. I will mo... <laughs> I'll, let, uh, I'll, uh, I'll uh, purely focus on the, on the herbs. Um, yeah, I don't really have uh, anything else to say. Nothing needs to be said. Uh, nothing much more needs to be said. I will be recording every episode or every quest I will record alone on its own um, by itself and uh, I may release them one episode at a time or one quest at a time and I'll also make a full video of all the quests done in uh, as if it was one segment uh, but it, it will be a split segment uh, completion of the entirety of this campaign I don't know exactly how many uh, how many uh, quests there are uh, 56 quests I made a small spreadsheet as well so that I can uh, keep track of it because there's no way of uh, keeping track of which ones you've already completed without using a herb and which ones you haven't apart from using uh, apart from manually uh, keeping track so that's what I did and yeah before going into each quest I will show you my equipment and then I'll go through the quest with a with a with a with a live commentary yeah that was the intro I hope that you'll enjoy this as much as me. All right. Since I've already gotten all the uh, titles, I will not be going for, the, for any titles. Uh, I think I could just go in and it will give me the basic setup anyways. Okay, here's for... Uh, good authentic stuff. I don't think I have any shields now. So. Yeah. I promise future equipment videos will be will be done once uh, when, when I've already my brain stopped functioning. Um, yeah, a future the future quests I'll have the equipment ready I promise so for this one just go with the basic village garb and high juice and uh, we're going in uh, we'll be skipping all this basically uh, no So here we're just gonna fight uh, these enemies uh, until that message come, and then we'll buy the wooden sword, and we'll just uh, do some leveling, do some quick leveling. Um, just to get ready for uh, for the next boss. 
uh, or for the uh, for the boss. Oh. Things are going great. We haven't met the time goddess yet, so it should have been game over. But the time goddess decides not today. We'll make a pact with her, and then we begin again. And we'll go in here. Time stops. We'll just heal up like normally. And uh, do some quick leveling here if you, if you feel insecure, uh, insecure about your level. But uh, yeah, once you see that message, you just go in here and beat him. You can also heal up beforehand. Yeah, that's the. Uh, first level making uh, progress this is the setup and I also noticed uh, during the first video that my mouse was uh, on the screen all the time I apologize for that I'll remember that as well this is the setup I'm going for a uh, form mission 2 it's still uh, these first levels are easy so it's wood sword tatty tags and then high juice Skip through all the text here and uh, can dash through these as well for some quicker adventuring. Maybe a bit premature. Uh, time makes it here. God, I can't. Uh, I can't multitask like this, can I? Get the hammer. I'm stronger than the evil now, so all we gotta do is go back here. Heal up. And then you can go down here, reset time again. You can get the bronze sword. Uh, I don't think you need the bronze sword, but uh, you might as well. Just rush through all this. Maybe not rush to you. the boss, you might die. Yeah, that's uh, level two, the uh, Continental Bridge. All right, level three, Lord Hadius, Lord Hadiers, Hadiers. I'm going with the Bronze Sword, Teddy Tanks, High Chill, and High Cheese here. Text. Got a bit closer. I got level up to level six. There we go. And I heal up. Uh, let's speak to yeah. Speak to this guy. No. Not yet. Go down to the cave here. Get the red diamond. Um. Yeah, basically go up here again. Speak to this guy. Uh, pray at the statue. Uh, to reset the time. And, uh. Let's see. monster here go down here speak to this guy and then you can set sail and you can choose to go through the tower here to get the uh, boom sword which I believe one shots the boss I could be wrong find out Yeah, it does. Or you can just go straight for the boss. No need to... No need to go for the boom sword. But yeah, that's uh, Lord Hadeus. Alright, for caves and forests, I'm going with the bronze sword 
and the tiny tags, not the anima plate now, merc shield and the hide shoes. So we got a big bug here and uh, I just want a tiny bit of lemon. Huh? Basically what we're going to do is go into this corner down here and speak to that guy, get the bugs water and we'll be able to smack everything in one shot, every bug at least. And there we go. Escapes in forest for you. Okay, for this one I chose, uh, sorry, for our fire starters, I chose a leather hat to look slightly better. Box water, I'll uh, explain in a second. Teddy tags, work shield, and high shoes. So, the box water in this level is absolutely amazing take two <laughs> okay so basically with the uh, box water we'll go up here there will always be three honeybees spawning you use that to power level yourself um, once you're out of health just run back here and uh, back time because we need those honeybees to a level is it you're above uh, the evil now I'm gonna continue until there's no more forest here I'm gonna continue to 12 yeah this is fine I'll buy the rock axe I'll buy this I'll heal up again just for good measure and I'll just run away really how I deal with this. I have no issue at all. You can run here as well, by the looks of it. Yeah. I also removed uh, OBS's ability to record the, uh, the uh, mouse because I kept forgetting. So. Yeah, that was uh, Fire Starters. Uh, in the speedrunning version to get this uh, if you do this below 27 seconds you get another achievement um i already got that one though and you need to utilize uh, uh, an herb as well and uh, you can't really use any herbs here so uh yeah that was a uh, fast start all right for through the forest I'm going with the leather hat, rock axe, barrel armor, merc shield, and the hide shoes again. Uh, I have a different plan then. First of all, there we go. Get the buckler now. didn't help as much as I hoped it did would against this grasshopper things maybe the forest is better and they just don't dash at all gotta keep my health at all costs uh, I could of course just hire Richard I think I'm gonna do to see how well he performs. Yeah, I'll go with this. Save my own HP. Yeah. Oh, I can heal here. That is amazing. Am I able to beat him now? The, uh, the Lord here? I should be able to. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So. Get some defense, hi Richard, and don't dash. Uh, stay back, let Richard's uh, pet attack, and uh, 
Richard, well, left those tanks for you, and uh, you should be able to do this uh, without any issues and without overleveling too much. But yeah, that was uh, through the forest. What a brambly path that was. All right, Courage Mountain is next, and uh, we got a pretty decent uh, gear upgrade overall. We got the Straw Hat, which is the uh, first. Uh, well, it's not the first, but it, it has stats compared to the leather hat from before. It's something. Uh, we're using the barrel armor and the buckler, uh, rubber boots, and the logger axe. Logger axe currently has. Pretty good stats, uh, plus 20 crit. I don't know if that's pure chance or or what that is, but uh, yeah, that's the equipment uh, we're going with here. How can I see myself in the mirror? Try again. If I cross, okay. Oh. Okay. open and we go up here don't put too much should be doable yeah okay good 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 that was a uh, purge mountain without any herbs okay infinite desert is the next one I'm going with the straw hat, a sailor suit, bronze lance, buckler and rubber boots. I'm not sure how I'm gonna go with this one. Um, actually, let me see what the price of the iron sword is. 250. Yeah. Got 68 here. So I can definitely get this. There we go. We can heal here and, uh, and pray here. Our right, Barbara. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna do. Actually, I might. Yeah, let's go, Barbara. Yeah, and we can, uh, and you have to go this specific way, otherwise you're teleported back to the beginning of the level, and uh, you don't want that. Yep, yeah, just rush this one, and uh, is uh, easily over with, easily done. That was uh, infinite desert. No herbs. Okay, village in danger. <clears throat> Sorry, village in danger. Uh, is the next one up and that's the final one before we go on the other path uh, 
Only two things really changed is the... Uh, I'll go through everything. Uh, mage glasses for... Boost my damage with a uh, one point. And the iron sword. Mainly just for the bulky plus seven. I had an idea of going quick knife plus the lavis mail. Uh, but you lose. The quick knife would give more movement to the bulky lavish mail and you'd have same damage you even have some more you know what let's try the quick mail lavish mail the uh, quick knife lavish mail mage glasses buckler rubber boots just way so much more um we'll try it out see how it works it's it shouldn't be it shouldn't shouldn't create any issues um yeah i'm just gonna get straight into it yeah, it doesn't seem too bad uh, get the medicine i think the medicine is up here if i remember correctly yeah, in the tent. Oh no. That village is destroyed. Yeah, the tent's left. Put the medicine on me. I understand. Can I go? Should I go there? Is the question more likely? Oh. Uh, yeah, reset the time and eat up by the rapier and uh, can move on. Basically, we uh, go to this rock, which fits perfectly with uh, us over the evil now. Or us being stronger than evil. That's it for a village in danger. Yeah. Right, for through the cave, uh, we're going back to the uh, to the other part uh, down here, the other path. Uh, I'm going. Uh, it, yeah, basically you can't use uh, stage six, seven, eight, nine equipment on a stage six. Um, so we have downgraded a bit. We got a leather hat, uh, rock axe for uh, raw damage, barrel armor, wood shield, and high shoes. And uh, I do not believe I remember this. As well. So we're gonna. Start leveling out a bit. Just until we can't anymore. Or uh, uh, just until we have to lose the time. That seems to be. Uh, time I can rush. Yeah. Basically, go in and reset the time and uh, have some eel stew. Should I check the food first? Uh. Go in here now. Wow, maybe not. Oh, bollocks. Uh oh. We can eat that ancient meal, but we don't have to. Jesus. I can't. Yeah, I'm gonna go do this instead. What the hell? No guy in the west hat knows a lot. Or, yeah, okay. Ah, oh, there was a hut here. Head south. Oh, okay. 
how do I get to the... Uh... I don't want to. Do I have to do this? Then eat this again. Let me go back to here. <gasps> I'm not sure uh, about those mechanics there. Yikes. Yeah, when you're as overpowered as me, uh, just uh, run through. Uh, yeah, you can just rush there. Yeah, this was a uh, very a bolt to the cave. <laughs> Next level is uh, Castle Over the Sea. And we're going to use the straw hat, logger axe, barrel armor, buckler, and rubber boots. Right. And we're just going to skip all of this. And, um... Uh, yeah, don't need to spend time by the first village here. Gonna go in and check. We have the sailor suit here. We could just save up for that. There we go. 230 coins. That basically just will level up. Once we reach level 6, you can. I'm 6 there, as right? so you can start uh, rushing these. And, uh. Where can I heal up? Can I heal here? I can heal here. Slice cactus. I can heal here, but no reason of time. That's fine though. Uh, okay. So now basically all we need to do is wait. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that yet. Go up here and heal, make sure you're completely healed. And just run across here. I think it's around uh, like 25 seconds or so. Uh, then you can run across. Yeah, that was a uh, castle over the sea. No webs. Next one up is good old days. Uh, we got a straw hat, bronze sack, sailor suit, buckler, and rubber boots. Sorry. Actually, let me quickly retry this. Just to see how quickly you can actually do it. Okay, take two. You don't need to go in here, never mind. Less than 20 seconds. Yeah. That's a pretty pretty fast one, pretty easy one as well. Yeah, that was a uh, good old days. <coughs> good job. <coughs> Jesus. Change the current is the next one. The final one of this path, and that they join again in Sage 10. Yeah, to cap up mage glasses, quick knife, and lavish mail, buckler, and rubber boots. Change the current. Yes. It is grinding time. Let's quickly see here. Yeah, we got some food here. I think 
can only... Okay. Like, heal ten times. Let me quickly check. You don't got snow food here. Oh, in that of this. Okay, I'm going to quickly heal. And then run up here. Pray. And... Going in to beat Kali. And we can now go north. Oh, we got food as well. So the question is how do we get. Oh, oh my. Yeah. It's down here. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. There we go. Pretty easy, level 9. Change current. No ads. Okay, we're trying a bit more raw damage base now. We got mage glasses, and we got the iron spear, and then the loincloth. Loincloth doesn't give that much defense. But more than teddy tags. Village down. Sure. Uh, Loincloth gives a ton of damage. Uh, using buckler and the rubber boots. We'll eventually start using spike shields here. Uh, but until then, bucklers. Just as good. Well, not just as good. Yeah. Beautiful evil hero. And... The evil lore in this one. Let's see, we got the charisma wig here for. Yeah. Um, we can pray here as well, so that's good. Let's see, what can we do here? We can eat for 30 and pray as well. Okay. Sweet. So I'm gonna do some easy leveling here now. Maybe in the forest? Typically the forest is a better place to level up. Maybe not always. Guess it depends on RNG as well. Um, I'm gonna go down here. I'm not gonna go down here. Actually, no, no mind. Sorry. I'm going to go down here. After all, and beat Nor. And then we save the girlfriend of the evil lord. And we bring the girlfriend here, and voila. We clear the level. And uh, we didn't use any herbs. Otherwise, we have to level up to like 33. And reset times a lot. Yeah. Beautiful evil lore. I said lore uh, for the last mission. It's actually a lord. I just can't type properly, so I wrote lore instead of lord and my brain thought hey yeah that sounds that's that sounds correct so the equipment hasn't changed at all mage glasses iron spear loincloth buckler and rubber boots it worked fine last time it should work fine this time as well worst case scenario we swap the loincloth for a fur coat that just unlocked which gives six more defense um we shouldn't have any issues just yet. Let's see here. Ooh. 
Okay. Eat up. Uh, I'm going to get the uh, silver spear and the reset. And we're just gonna insta kill all these big ones. This might have been a dumb idea. Oh, okay. Uh, remember to save some health before it gets here. <laughs> oh my god. I could have gone horribly wrong. But it, uh, it went fine, so uh, yeah. Banded Valley. Quick and easy. Road to land or sea. And the final quest before the big path branching. Um, yeah, mage glasses, iron spear, loincloth, buckler, and rubber boots. I was kidding. Uh, sorry, I do apologize. Bugs water. I hadn't read the guide properly. run from these battles and we got a one shot incoming here and we are over leveled buy the hide armor buy the curry and uh, just run to the boss here and there you go less than 30 seconds both titles And we even got the hide armor. No webs. All right, for the next one, it is. Let me check here. Hero in the dusk. Oh my gosh! I'm sorry. Mage glasses, iron spear, loincloth, buckler, and the rubber boot. Yeah, here in the dusk. Guides is here in the dark. Different regional version. Silver Rush in the beginning. Is that rushing when you reach like? At least if we have more defense. Using a life cloth isn't actually the optimal choice, defense wise. Uh, yeah. Let's see where this takes me. Just gonna level up somewhere along the way. Of time before going back here. If you don't have to rush like this. But 
now they should have returned to this town again. You can eat here as well and buy the 10 gallon hat. If you want to. And just rush on to Evil Lord here. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Hero in the dusk. Okay, for none, none and the devil, I'm going mage classes and I'm switching my weapon up to Frostbear. Yeah, uh, hide armor for more. Uh, we don't need the extra DPS boost from the loincloth. Uh, extra defense. Uh, it's not a bad choice. A buckler and rubber boots. Basically no damage here at all. What if I go in here? Oh. Not a good idea. <laughs> Just stay outside the village and uh, keep on leveling until we reach uh, the time resets. Then go through the uh, tower here. That was actually pretty close. To clear the tower, and go up north here. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'd want to get up there in time. Quite far north. First, we say no. Rush through. Yes. completely and uh, yeah heal up completely and reset time probably before entering the castle but yeah that was uh, herbless nun and the devil all right equipment mage glasses iron spear hide armor buckler and rubber boots we are doing past the ocean Herbless. Right. I'm gonna continue doing some grinding here. Set. Uh, eat up, get the swimmer ring. Yeah, I should be able to just uh, pray again, eat up, and uh, go straight north. No? Ah, oh, do I have to get into the hole? 
Holy mother. Jesus. Okay. Uh, oh, I, I need you. Okay. What was that? Let me try again. Jesus. to go in there. I'll need to go in the bottom left corner. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, that was... Uh, that's the ocean. Alright. Battle Ocean is the next one on our list. Mage Glasses, Frost Spear, Hide Armor, Buckler, and Rubber Boots. And we're going to move straight into it. to just uh, reset time here. Fire crown, heavy armor, maybe. Then just go for it. Oh. We have to do the cave first. And it does not open where... Supposed to be this over leveled. Okay. Yeah, so basically just go through the cave uh, and uh, once you've been there, you sail and kill the uh, evil lord. But yeah. Okay, next up is Lizard Man Nation to follow on this path. Uh, I'm going with Mage Glasses, Longsword, Chainmail, Buckler, and Rubber Boots. Uh, Steel Shield is here. Costs.
and my Phil Steel Shield. Enough for a reset and probably some food. Food. Shield. Scale helmet. How about the fortress? Or oh, forest. Fortress. The forest. It's the wrong one. Okay, for Treasure Island, I'm going Mage Glasses, Steel Spear, Chainmail, Scale Shield, and Rubber Boots. Yeah. thing to do is just stay here and level up uh, and you can do that pretty easily yeah until you reach the you're stronger than evil and just run up and uh, make sure you have uh, plenty of health and time just run up and kill him Okay, for Dragon Island, I'm going Mage Glasses, Frostbear, Hide Armor, Buckler, and Rubber Boots. Just level up to level 15 and just rush the evil on. Or oh, we can do that now. Uh, I don't need the dragon lands. I'll get the rice. See if this is enough. 
Should be. Oh, yes. All that enough. Easy does it. Alright, so for a tiny sailing trip... Actually, no. Just realized. I'm going mage glasses, dragon lance, swimmer ring, buckler, and rug boots. Yeah. There's not really any defense to get here. I don't have any hats unlocked yet. I can get a shield. Like, I can use Merc Shield for plus one defense. Uh, but you have to use the Swimmer Ring as well. Uh, yeah. Um. Yes, I have this silver hammer available here. Oh. Going here for some quick levels. You have the coral crown here for some more defense. Cannot enter from here. Okay. Increase the time here. Maybe a bit early to come here. We'll find that in a second. Yeah, probably a bit too early to come here. Actually, no. Okay. That went decent. Okay, for a flower in the dusk, a uh, scale helmet, steel spear, chainmail, scale shield, and rubber boots. What we're going to do is just, uh, just farm some levels. And get the boots from this town. And then just go for the evil lord. You can rush here if you want to s s speed it up a bit. Another relatively easy level. Okay, going down the Devil's Path, we have um, devil, uh, the Devil's Powers uh, from the mission in None of the Devil. You technically, doing all playthroughs, you save uh, a nun, I think, and you save a devil. And this is the Devil's Path. Lord's Counterattack. So, we're going with Flower Crown, Quick Knife, Chainmail, Rubber Boots, and a Buckler. We are um, going to hop straight into it because we're going to be quite overpowered. <laughs> Alright, take two. Uh, we're going to be leveling a tiny bit. Not because we need it. That much, but because it's just let's see here. Just gonna check here. Nope. Uh, gonna go back and reset time. Yeah. 
heal up. So, I tried before and I basically got smacked by the by the demon. Uh, I'm thinking here. No, we don't need to. Probably could have done it before. I just didn't start running at the, at the beginning. Um, obviously, you won't see my first try. So that's Lord's counter attack with no herbs. For Twin Valley, I'm just going to stick with this equipment. Basically, um, actually, I might. Yeah, I'll use a scale shield. No, I'll use a merc shield. For one extra defense. You don't need the damage buff uh, to choose something else than the quick knife. Um, I don't think we have much available with as much crit either. So we're gonna go with the quick knife, the chainmail, um, actually, yeah, and the rubber boots. I wonder how quick I can just enter this. I can enter it now. Seal with magic. Ah, uh, okay. So that's going to be a bit annoying. Uh, because we have to do a lot of quests. A lot of unnecessary quests. The Red Castle Seal is lifting. Okay. Maybe not uh, as many quests. I don't know which of these I need to do. I'm just gonna continue doing quests until uh, until she says uh, otherwise. Like now, okay. So either do one set of quests uh, in each town or. Just one quest, even. I'm not sure. Um, but we got through it. No herbs. Ancient riches. I am a master of this one by now. Uh, flower crown, quick knife, chainmail, merc shield, and rubber boots. Yes. Take two. So I got the bad ending before, as I've done at least 10 times now, uh, playing through the normal game, thinking the game was bugged beyond reason. And it turns out it's just me being silly. Ooh. The stuff that's nonsense. And uh, we'll go down here, speak to this dude, they'll move up here, and we have two bombs every day now. go in here, get one item, go up here, get another chest, and that's it. Can we reset the time, eat up, get a big bump, explode this, get another big bump, take this down, and then we can uh, do the, uh, the evil lord. This time we'll get the good ending. 
There we go. Easy does it. Easy does it. All right. So for the final uh, branch of the main path here, um, Mummy Desert. Yeah, I'm going with Mage Glasses, Crossbear, Chainmail, Merc Shield, and Rubber Boots. So more or less the usual setup. Scale shield. Is there anything here? No. to eat up as well. Otherwise, just go straight for the boss because we uh, out-leveled the boss a long time ago. Evil Lord completed. Or, uh, well, Mummy Death is completed. Evil Lord vanquished. Vanquished? Van vanished. Vanished, vanquished. No ebbs. Okay, Spinning Castle is up next, and depending on whether you want more damage or not, you can go for a different hat, or you can go for a different uh, armor set. I mean, if you want more damage, you can literally use the loincloth. You'll lose 2 weight and uh, 10 armor, by the looks of it, but you gain plus 5 attack. I'm going for this setup. Mage Glasses, Steel Spear, Chainmail, Scale Shield, Rubber Boots. Oh, let's go. just reset time, eat, and run out here. There we go. Yeah. Another one bites the dust. Okay. I'm not sure when I got the captain hat, but the captain hat is a direct upgrade to the mage glasses for raw damage. Uh, you get uh, plus two instead of plus one. You can also go more defense with the scale helmet, but uh, apart from that, there aren't really any great choices. Um, you still got the flower crown if you want more crit chance, but uh, we get enough crit chance through the weapon as is. So, Captain Hat, Steel Spear. Can go with the Saw Axe instead, but you just, you'll end up moving a bit slower. Uh, or you can just remove the plus 30 crit for one more damage. Uh, I'm going with the... Uh, I'm going with the Steel Spear. You can also use the Gladius, I 
used to love using the Gladius. Not much weight and you get some movement as well. Has a decent crit and decent attack, but uh, I'm going uh, Steel Spear, Chainmail, Duralumen. And the Scale Sandals. For one. Yeah, you can remove one weight and one armor. You use a battle boost instead. I'm going to use the Scale Sandals. So. Wow. Take three. Yeah, I'm just being silly here. Okay, I'm gonna level up here instead. Better. Dilla, pray. And I think this is the northeast. This was not the northeast. Okay. Whoa, I'm gonna head back. What about this one? Thanks, buddy. Okay. So now we can uh, go do the boss. We got the big bomb. And it's pretty easy. It took me three tries though. Jesus. Easy. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm going to try with a completely different setup than like raw damage. Just um, I'm going with Bonehead here, which gives a plus one damage, plus one armor and plus 10 crit instead of the plus two damage. Uh, Wing Blade is by far the best choice right now. Uh, the stats are 15 and 5. And then 20 crit and 15 movement as well. There's nothing else that comes even close to these stats right now. Uh, with, I'm actually going with the anima plate to test out how slow do I actually move because it gives a ton of defense. I'm going with the spike shield for plus 2 attack defense. Plus 5 uh, weight and plus 10 uh, uh, crit defense. Anti crit. And then scale sandals here. You can go with battle boots as well. Yeah, this is this is my setup. Again, if you're using if you're using equipment from uh, which uh, or if you're just using some of the highest level equipment you currently own, you shouldn't have any issues, regardless of the equipment. Round two, fight. So I got the bad ending before. Um, that wasn't. Uh, I'm, I'm, it is an ending. I'm not sure if it counts as uh, an ending. You can uh, count towards the no herb run. So, um, yeah, I'm not, uh, we got the grail now. Okay. We got all of, all of them. It's not here. Ah, right. Okay. Now, now we have the actual grail. Oh, 
we'll just reset time here. Um, actually, we're gonna go back and heal up as well. I will use the Grail. This time he can't return. So yeah, use the Grail. And voila. Okay, um, sorry. For to the snowy count to this to the snowy country. I already thought I had done this. Apparently I skipped it earlier. Uh Captain Hat, Steel Spear, Chainmail, Durlumin, and Skill Sandals. Pretty average stats on the side there. Uh, overall, so that's uh, pretty good. Now, this is a place where I should have uh, trained to level 15. Instead of the other one where I'm said I was going to train to level 15 and then by level 10 I was like, uh, excuse me, where do I go? What's going on? Yep. Get the silver sword and I need to go back here and uh, heal. Yeah. Just keep on training here. Don't need to rush anything. Reset time one to reset level 15. I'm going to this here at the Northeast Cave. And uh, Northeast Cave again. Plus these Peggies. And straight into the boss here. Yeah. Cold blooded. Oh, that's the time. Uh, to the snow country. The new ones. Okay, uh, Avalanche Pass, uh, Bonehead, Wing Blade, Anima Plate, Spike Shield, and Scale Sandals. It worked out pretty well before, uh, so I'm gonna do it again. And now there's no need to be afraid of uh, the avalanche falling down upon you anymore. I would like to be a bit stronger than the uh, evil. But I think it'll come uh, on its own on my way to towards the towards the castle. Maybe not. I feel we have enough uh, defense anyways. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Probably could have gone in earlier. Avalanche pass done. And that is the last of the mid-game branches. Later on we're going to have some more branching in there. Uh... Yeah. It's going to be fun. Avalanche pass. No herbs. Okay, for White Earth, I'm going for Bonehead, Wing Blade, Chainmail, Spike Shield, and Speed Gear. I just want to try out the more or less the same as before, but with much more movement and 
uh, slightly less defense. Definitely less uh, weight. So, uh, yeah, let's try it out. Here there are monsters. We're already stronger than evil. I'm just gonna go straight up and uh, destroy him. Easy does it. White Earth completed. So for this uh, Great Plains, I'm gonna use Captain Hats, Silver Sword, Scale Mail, Spike Shield, and Scale Sandals. Oh, I remember this one now. So you need the horse and not the kite shield. Never mind. I'll get it later. I need it. Maybe I won't. Eat. Yeah, basically what you gotta do here is uh, smack up all these uh, cannons. You can easily do that. Gotta heal up again. Take down this guy at least. Just gonna take down a few more of these cannons. There we go. You versus evil. Just run up here and uh, take down this evil guy. Make sure you have enough health and enough time. And uh, voila. Great planes completed. Okay, Floodgate Panic. I'm going to use Scale Helmet, the Night Lance, Swimmer Ring, Spike Shield, and Speed Gear. You don't have a lot of defense for this, so... Uh, yeah. It should be... Uh, it's pretty doable. Anyway, so... This is gonna farm. Take two. I'm gonna heal up immediately. Oh my god. Defense is, uh, or the non existing defense is absolutely horrible. The heal up, pray, and uh, yeah, get the get the spike mask, uh, the spike mace. Going here, uh, go through here, take the second door to the west one, follow the path. Ooh, okay, make sure you have enough health going in here. Jesus. And 
Yeah, you can get booted back. Just uh, heal up and, and pray here. Ever so slowly move uh, forward. Hey, you can. Uh, you can go in here and uh, open the path this way, or you can just swim across. Because you have the swim ring after all, so. Yeah, that was uh, closer than I thought it was going to be. You may not need the uh, swimmering after all. That depends on when, whether you're going for the handle or not. You don't need the handle, so. That was Floodgate, a very botched Floodgate panic. No webs. Okay, so for a giant evil lord, I'm going with Bonehead, Spike Mace, Silver Mail, Spike Shield, and Speed Gear. You can see the stats are getting pretty, pretty, pretty decent overall. Yeah, just gonna go straight into it. Hmm. Also very slow. Oh, let's do it. That heavy silver mail is not helping at all. If you want something... Maybe a bit faster, a bit faster setup, you don't... I mean, you don't need the silver mail. Uh, get the Crimson Row up here and the Orchid Helm. Start moving. The second here you can eat up. Sebastian joints. You can try and go for uh, go for uh, the giant here. Shouldn't cause too many trouble. Uh, too too many problems too much trouble yeah that's uh that's it for this stage all right so for the have nots another level i am a very very big opponent of um now the uh, i'm going to do use the bonehead spike mace silver mail spike shield and scale sandals same as with giant evil lord but with different boots this time i'm gonna test um how my movement is compared to when using the speed gear so yeah um gonna get straight into it We're not the fastest of characters to ever tread this world. Um, yeah, let's see how far we against this. That quest is not good, actually. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. I'd kind of recommend something with a bit more movement speed than this. Maybe not the silver mail, the chain mail will definitely suffice. Uh, because this is very, very slow. But we need uh, at least 200 for the uh, uh, to pray, and we also need so yeah. So one more quest done here should do the trick. While we're here, we can might as well pray and uh, eat up and 
pay this guard. Now that we have paid the guard, we can go up here to the... This place here. Go through the gate and... Defeat the evil lord. getting this below 30 seconds. Okay. So for Fire Mountain, I'm going with the Horned Helmet. Uh, it's just a better version of Bonehead, really. Or a more defensive version of Bonehead. Uh, Evil Breaker is not the one. A Gold Rush, I'll try and use to see how it's like without a uh, crit chance. But uh, with a uh, high attack instead. Uh, the chain mail because the gold rush is really heavy. Um, the spike shield and Bigfoot, which is uh, a pair of shoes that's fast but and, and a bit defensive but uh, very heavy. But yeah. We'll just, uh... Ooh, yeah, we're moving very slow. We're smashing everything, though. Very bulky as well. Basically what we need is to uh, get to level 15. Um, I'll get the metal helm. Not sure how it is uh, compared to the horn helm. Apart from losing some defense. Let me check here. Can you eat anywhere? Doesn't look like it. It's very interesting. Okay. Level sixteen. Level seventeen. Okay. There's some deal. Mm, yeah, this is going to be an issue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's not good. So I'll pray up and uh, I guess I'll try and do these quests. I don't know if that would help. It's just... Nowhere. Unless I can go to a town here and heal up. That doesn't look like it. I got the first rock. Um... up again the second rock uh, yeah I'm gonna continue leveling up a bit Twenty-five. It should be good enough soon. Should. Okay. 
ค่ะโอเคนะไม่รับสักโอเคว่าไงไอ้I don't think it's gonna be enough. I mean, I don't understand. <laughs> oh my god! How is this possible? Stay here until, and then they'll see. Oh my God! Thank you very much. You're our savior. I got the tiger blade, and everyone's happy. And I'll go to this place. And okay, I'm gonna raise the time. Just gonna run from the battles now. We'll have to see now. Okay. Jesus. And all that because you can't heal. Ah. Uh. That was a grindy one. That was a pretty grindy one compared to compared to the others. I think I read somewhere that this was. Going to be the hardest one to do without any herbs, uh, because there's literally no place to heal up. So, <sighs> yep. Fire Mountain, no herbs. Okay, uh, moving a bit closer. Here. Right for Turtle and Hermit, we. We got the horn tail, the tiger blade, the crimson robe, the spike shield, and Bigfoot. Yeah. All right. What we're going to do is basically go in here and. Uh, Just gonna do this. For an eternity. Because this is giving a lot of HP. Uh, XP, sorry. You can see a level 19 already. Time almost ran out. Back for more. Now where you should be able to just uh, defeat the boss. There we go. Quite an easy level. Easy to level up, easy to easy to complete. Okay, and then for the Swamp and Witch, I'm going to use Horned Helm, Wide Saber, Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Bigfoot. Then we're gonna 
pray and eat and get these bronze shoes. I don't really think we need to get the bronze shoes. Okay. Already now at this point in time. The uh able to push through it hopefully yeah also a relatively easy one you might want to make sure you have enough uh, health and uh, and time left when you start going through the muddy path yeah okay for the isolated castle I'm going horned helm sage stuff Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Gale Shoes. See what else is uh, around and about. But right here, I'll hire Barbara. What about this town? Just for equipment wise, nothing here. Oh. Nothing here either. Let me go back up here and uh, pray up. Make sure I get past this one. There we go. Get the thunder hat. The music in this game, it's so good. Uh, heal and pray, and I'm gonna go for it. Oh, so the Thunder Hat basically makes you immune to, to that shit. Gotcha. By the looks of it. Alright, that was, um... Isolated castle. Then after this, uh, the next one we're going to go for the uh, all of the, uh, the, the the hidden levels, quote unquote hidden levels. But yeah, isolated castle. No herbs. Okay, Golem Valley. We're now going for the uh, other path, and afterwards we are going to go here, take the hidden levels for. Quote unquote, in levels. So, Golem Valley equipment, Horned Helm, Tiger Blade, Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Big Boot. First, strain. So, first, uh, the first almost 30 seconds is the. Uh, Now, I sometimes wish I could speak. So for the first almost 30 seconds, I'm going to be leveling here. I get the shield, pray up, heal up. Thank you. 
Oh shoot, okay. I need to go here. I get the screw. Go through here. Activate. Keep on running. Okay. Okay. There we go. Now we can go here. And just run into here and take out the boss. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh, okay. Quickly gonna level up. Then after the next reset, I'm gonna go for the boss again. Could have been interesting. There we go. I can go for the circlet now, but I'm just gonna go for the boss instead. And then just let uh, Golem chunk these. There we go. We made it in the end. Golem Valley, no webs. All right, for uh, Treasure Land, it's take two because it didn't start recording the first time. So I've been I did the level, then I realized, oh wait, I have to do it again. So Horn Helm, White Saber, Crystal Rope, Spike Shield, and Big Foot. Zoom. As I'm leveling up, I'm uh, going to slowly move towards this town here. Hmm. We get relatively strong defense, so I'm just going to move up towards here, the next town. And uh, just gonna start moving towards the castle. Should it be, yeah, above evil now. Take these ones out and then just run towards. Very interesting name. Treasure land completed. No apps. Okay. Um, for this one, we need. Uh, I'm going to use a Horned Helm, Dragonlance, Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Bigfoot. Right. We have a lot of friends here, and uh, yeah, we aren't really doing that much. Once we, if, once we level up after the first fight, we're basically steamrolling them. If we could go straight, and there's a big dragon here lurking somewhere up in the mountains. If we could go straight for it, that would be preferable. But we can't. Uh, these sorts of uh, monsters that we have to get past. Maybe we can just... Maybe we could have rushed it. Um... Yeah, we don't need the... Uh, we don't really need the Bauman. We just need to go in here. Get our ass whooped. Which is going to take one shot. And there we go. This level crashed for me continuously in um, in the Neo 
the non-retro graphics settings. That level continuously crashed for me. Yeah, the return of Hull completed. Don't even need the Dragonlands if you're just going for a no herb run. Okay, Time Destroyer. Prince Crown, this is just... Oh, it's good. So much damage. And the Balmung is absolutely crazy. The Crimson Robe, the Spike Shield, and the Gale Shoes. Can use Bigfoot as well. Maybe I should use Bigfoot. Uh, I don't really have that much weight. I'm not sure if it weight is going to be relevant or not, but... Uh, it's never a bad thing. Unless you have too much. We have uh, very little right now. So, let's see what we can do here. I'm just gonna follow my... Uh... Do I go in here? I can. Yeah. Okay. Ah, bollocks. I wasn't gonna be here. I didn't plan on being here. Well. Uh, might as well take it nice and slow. Just go on top of these uh, this arrow one of them actually go in and smack the dragon easy does it time destroyer no way okay no turning back we're using the uh, not the break crown we're using the uh, prince crown the balmung Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Time Boots. Could use Dual Greaves for a uh, slightly less weight and much less uh, boot, well, speed. Uh, but we get some defense and attack as well. It's up to you whether you want uh, to use Dual Greaves or Time Boots. It's very doable in both cases. This is just more of the glass cannon build the raw damage build lots of damage lots of delicious delicious damage right let's get straight into it take three So when you when you defeat all of the uh, all of the uh, uh, enemies, you get more time afterwards. Yeah. Um, no turning back. No webs. Okay. For the false hero, we're going to go a bit more defensive, going Sylph, Sarit, Balmung, Light Armor, Time Shield, and Iron Boots. Oh, 
Uh, actually, let me just. Uh, I don't need to get the fleet food power up. I don't think I need to get it. Oh, too bad. Excuse me. Was this one? Hey, okay, sweet. I can eat here in recent time again. Can I get something from here as well? Or was that the other? No, there is not the same. Uh, reset the time. I guess I'm gonna go into here now. Got the walking stick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, got a walking stick. Can I go up here? No. Okay. Try and speed up a little. Gonna go through here. Sure. Drink up and pray and can I go here now? Yeah. Okay. There we go. There we go. The false hero completed. Not using any herbs. Okay, for when time sits still, we're back to focusing more on damage. We actually even have some uh, some good armor. So, Prince Crown, Balmung, Light Armor, Time Shield, and Dual Greaves. Reaching peak armor here. time go back here and eat up you can't buy that doesn't matter pray and uh let's start time again move back towards this village eat up pray move towards here Do I need to speak with the little guy? Maybe. There's gonna be an... This is what it is. Basically, I have to hit it exactly like between 
1950 and 20 seconds or 950 and 10 seconds and I missed the 21 we had to wait a bit when times are still no apps okay <clears throat> for the final time beast we're going prince crown hero sword lord mail time shield do all this this looks like the enchanted sword in terraria kinda ah. okay. we are not the fastest of uh Adventurers right now. Yeah, we don't take much damage anymore. So that's good at least. Okay. Pray and heal and go up. Smack this dude. Then we move on to the next one here. And uh, might as well pray and heal. Now that you're here. Straight for the next one as well. If you feel brave, you can just go for uh, the boss. At this point, it shouldn't be hard. So, uh, yeah, the final time beast. No herbs. Okay. We're basically using the best equipment in the game now. Uh, we're using the Brave Crown. Look at the stats, man. The time spare. We could be using the Brave Blade as well. 40 attack and 10 weight, 5 defense and 30 crit. Uh, but I'll rather go with the plus 5 attack and the plus 5 weight and minus 10 uh, accuracy and less defense as well. Uh, Brave Vest. These stats are incredible. The Time Shield. Uh, there aren't really any other interesting looking shields. You can go for a bit. I mean, if you feel you lack defense a bit, you could go for the shine shield. Uh, I just go for the... Actually, I could go for the spike shield instead. Uh, depending on what shield you use, it shouldn't be the thing that changes the outcome of this mission. Uh, here, I'll just be going for the dual greaves. For more attack and defense or you could go for time boots for more movement speed because we're quite heavy here um yeah basically we're first gonna go here and grab this dude And uh, yeah, we're just gonna plow through everything. There's nothing here that can uh, just make sure you can uh, fix the bridge and uh, pray here. And we're crossing the bridge. Going through here and yeah, you should really just be rushing through this without any issues and make it here to this next town where you can pray and heal again. And we're gonna get a third. Here, 
Bad time mode saved. You can you can heal or uh, at least pray up here, and then you can you decide yourself if you wanna do some leveling here. I mean, it's quite leveling here is uh, quite good XP uh, against the sharks. I use this to get to level 99 in in the run where I had to kill the final boss with the bronze sword. So that's very doable here. Just get to 50 or something. Reset the time. And then rush back through the cave. You can go up here now. And uh, just gonna go past, run past these. Um, down here, really, kill this dude. Get this Time Lord, go through this cave. And at this town, we heal and pray again. They rush over here through this tunnel. You break the seal. Or the, br the barrier. Get Galmetas. Back to the cave. Uh, if you feel uh, unsure whether you can make it or not, just uh, pray and heal here. Back through the cave. And uh, I mean, we're level 6 now. There really shouldn't be any issues. But uh, a final pray and a final heal. And uh, break the barrier. Break the time seal. And just go through. Got quite close, eh? <laughs> Maybe level up a bit more. Um, but yeah, you. Hey! Not sure if it uh, picks up the achievement, but I got the legalized it already achievement now. Um, I wasn't sure whether or not I need to do the other levels. So I'm gonna do the, uh, the other levels as well uh, without using any herbs. But after that, it sh yeah, should be any any issues. The hero of all time, no herbs. All right, down to using a well-known setup again: the Prince Crown, Balmung, Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and the Bigfoot. Going straight into Grand Wings. Got five levels to go after having beaten the. Other ones as well. He had a few. What do you do here? You go start going northeast, leveling as we go. Continue moving upwards. Got the dragon leaf. We go back to this place again. Yeah. Now we have a, a dragon. Basically. Not basically. We actually have a dragon now. We can speed around without a... Being afraid of losing health. Let's uh, try the boss. Save the dragons? Okay. I'll save the dragons. He's doing so well. a lot of damage. Yeah, maybe we should uh, heal up uh, and level a bit more then. Pretty sure there's something in here as well. There's a big boss here. Nice. We get the dual greaves, right. Right. 
Was there anything there? No. What about this down here? Nothing. Well, we should be able to take down the boss now. Oh yes, no issues whatsoever. Grand wings. No webs. All right. Farewell, bandit trio. Basically the same setup as before, but different boots. Uh, so Prince Crown, Balmung. Balmung's just so good, man. Crimson Robe, Spike Shield, and Dual Greaves. We can use Time Boots as well for increased speed, but I'm going with Dual Greaves for the increased damage. You, there is a thing with the Dual Greaves, though, that you can't run away. You can't flee in battles while you're wearing the Dual Greaves. That is a small price to pay. Small, small... What did I say? It's, <laughs> it's a small price to pay for... Uh, the extra bonuses. So. What we're going to be doing is just continuously level up here. Where are all these snakes go from? Um, yeah, heal up and uh, pray up. Okay, can't go there for some reason. Hmm. This town. Can't go in here. Yet. That's fine. I don't know where I'm going. Some shallow spots are actually holes, depending on the time. Oh, right. Okay. So. I know where it is. Oh. Okay. I think I found it. You can get the iron boots if you want to. I'm not gonna. Right. I can't go back here. That sucks. <laughs> What's going on? Oh my god. Okay. Go into the nearby tunnel. Now go into the nearby tower. I can't go there. I literally can't enter. It's so weird. Wind is caused by a monster on an island north of the castle. Uh, a bit of west. Am I going to the wrong side? I was going to the wrong side. Oh. I do apologize. Yeah, now we can go here. And it should be the easiest battle in human history. Oh my god. That was so bad. That was... <laughs> Farewell, Bandit Trio. No apps. For Infinite Weapon Lord. I'm going basically the same, but... Sorry. Different armor. Prince Crown, Balmung, Light Armor, Spike Shield, and Dual Greaves. Yes. 
we will be farming by the first village until I'm level 20. And, uh... Then I'm just gonna rush the castle. Oh no. Took the weapon. What travesty. Okay. Pray up, heal up, and... I do it at level 18 as well. 18, 19. Infinite weapon lord? No. Oops. For the cursed hero quest, um, basically the same setup as before. Uh, Prince Crown, Balmung, Light Armor, Spike Shield, and the Dual Greaves. I had to try a few times uh, for this one as well. Also very different music. Keep moving. Go into here, speak with this lady. Continue moving upwards. Uh, I'd say r fight the battles, but rush through the battles. You get up here, you have to fight three evil soldiers. And now we run back to the town down here. Actually, couldn't we just... Uh... No. Okay. Speak with her again. Uh, actually, go back and pray as well. Oh, did I buy a herb? A herb. Well, don't buy an herb. Yeah. And then you can buy these. Things if you wanna. Yeah, go in here and defeat this evil lord. And uh, no. Oh, okay. Yeah, run back here. No. Where do I go? Oh, here, into the town. And yeah, heal up. Run up here. This tomb. Then run back to the fortress. Forest. Fortress. Forest. The sword thingy. Say yes. Run back up. Break the monument. And uh. Pray. Oh, shoot. Okay. Yeah, make sure you have some money so you can pray. That was incredibly stupid. Yeah, don't don't run from <laughs> don't run from all of the battles. Make sure you have enough money to pray and uh, and eat up. And then once you're ready, go down here to this town and uh, defeat all of them. Uh, 
faster than saving a girl. Yeah. Going in reset time. Eat up. And go in here. And just defeat this dude. You can run. Yeah, should go down. And that was Cursed Hero. Second last level of the game. No worries. Okay, we're going a heavy defense approach here on last battle. With the Horned Helm, Hero Sword, Lord Mail, Time Shield, and Time Boots. Not the Time Shield. The Royal Guard, Time Boots, Lord Mail. I'd like to see how you can do this in 30 seconds. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go into every town and pick up a friend. Wherever they may be. and heal after that one. Yeah, make sure you level up as much as possible. No need to rush to avoid... Uh, unless you're about to run out of time, there's no need to rush to avoid uh, uh, the battles. You need all the XP you can get your hands on. Just run back here and reset your time. You might want to speed up uh, just a tiny bit. Just to avoid getting a... Uh, zero seconds left on the counter. Okay. So what we will do here is... almost run out. So I'm just gonna check here how strong I am. I don't think I'm strong enough. No. Yeah, so what we need to be is a much higher level. Uh, 
Like, is it possible for me to... Yeah, I can. I got the Brave Helm, the Brave Vest, the Brave Shield. Not the Brave Blade. Uh, all right, so the Brave Blade is up here. It's actually down here. There we go. We got all the brave equipment now, so we're basically set for everything. Now we just need the levels. I don't know if uh, monsters up here give more experience. This is where I'll level up. I'll try now again. to do it in time. I didn't even survive him. Okay. I'll level up some more. I guess. I mean, I don't really have any other choice. I could try again, I just don't think uh, it would change the outcome at all. The guide says to be at least level 64. <laughs> now would be a bad time to run out of uh, seconds on your clock. And one more. Nope. Oh, 69. There goes 70. Now that we're above the evil, we shouldn't be able to do damages at all. We should just smash them down. Yeah, just continue to ram them down. Eventually, you'll take them down. And voila. Last battle. No herbs.